It's National Mead Day, so I'm going to start with a toast to National Mead Day! Welcome to Ask the Mead Maker, where I, Ricky the Mead Maker, answer your questions about mead making, mead drinking, mead brewing, and really any question you're willing to send to me. I got a little overzealous with my quaffing earlier, so I have a new shirt now, but it's National Mead Day, and we had an amazing day at the Mead Hall with mead demonstrations, and I was going to shoot this episode there, but I forgot the chip for my camera, so I got some cool footage that you're going to see in a minute, but we hosted Rob Frizzell two-time Vermont Mead Maker of the Year and six-time Daytime Emmy hopeful. He's never appeared in a daytime television show, but it's how he wanted to be billed in this episode. Anyway, we had a great time and it was really cool because most of you know I started as a home brewer. I believe every single mead maker on the planet started as a home brewer because there is no school for mead making. So it was really neat for me to see all these people show up at the Mead Hall to learn a little bit more. And what was even cooler was most of them knew something I didn't know. So I wanted to, rather than answer your questions on this episode, thank all of you. Because what I know is mostly because you've asked me questions over the last five years, and I have answered them. And I didn't know the answer before I had to experiment or look it up or in many cases call other professional mead makers and pretend that I was the one that figured it out. So I wanna say thanks to Rob for pushing my mead making along and all the other people that showed up at the mead hall today to learn a little bit about mead making and teach me some things I didn't know. Keep sending your questions because I would love to learn more and I'll see you soon. Cheers. <laughs>